Hello there guys, my name is Coach Shadow Donksterborn, but built for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News room update where today we are officially confirming some news. Now, this is the sort of conclusion, if you like, to the Shaman Saga of Gardaland. And this is going to close this chapter, boom, off to another story. And yes, there still might be some, ex some excitement about the future of Gardaland, your know, potentially 2022 investment. Uh, could be very exciting if the rumours are true. But... Uh, this is closing off one chapter and moving on to the next. This is confirming what's going to be happening to Shaman at Gardaland. Now, we had an idea of what was going to happen, but there was still some doubt over whether it was going to stay and be retracked. However, Gardaland have officially confirmed that it is being retracked. We do have a statement uh, from Team Loopings on Twitter, and uh, I'm going to share with you the official statement uh, that was given to them on Twitter. Now, um, this is sort of replying, this sort of a reply, should we say, from Gardaland. Um, and actually, someone actually commented on the on the most recent Shaman video with a similar kind of statement or reply from Gardaland. And so this is just going to whole, you know, confirm it basically. So before we get started, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss another YouTube video. We're getting closer and closer to two thousand subscribers and and we are on the road to one million views in total which would be sh amazing as nicole scherzing would say on x factor sh amazing um now this is gonna be brilliant this will be brilliant and um let's get into this video let's get straight into it and let's discuss some stuff on shaman let's have a look at the statement via garland so this is what they officially said. On the basis of an important project began in 2018, Gardaland has started the renovation of part of the structure of the Shaman attraction, the first fixed roller coaster installed in Italy and built in 1984. In particular, Gardaland is going to replace part of the existing route with modernized track that comply the uh, updated regulations of the sector. The support points or the weight bearing columns will remain the same. The route won't change. Today we are proceeding with great care and attention moving the old rails using three big crane trucks and advanced cutting tools and preparing everything to welcome the new track. Uh, now the projects will allow to renovate an historical and symbolic attraction of the park much loved by the visitors who will have the possibility to continue experiencing the emotion that these roller coaster has always given. So that was the official statement from sort of Gardaland via Twitter. Uh, from a news site that was sort of the, the, the sort of statement should we say that was given to a news site via Gardaland on Twitter and this is explaining exactly what's going on so basically it's ripping out the old track bringing in the new ones uh, it's sort of fitted with what we saw on the construction site with the recycling of old track uh, being sent to the scrapyard and you know the three sort of cranes and the cutting tools uh, involved at the scrapyard and on site as well um, so, it, it, you know, and to be fair, you know, let, let's not be hasty here. I did say that the most likely option will be a retrap, but of course we're not ruling anything out at an early stage. Now we can officially confirm it is going to be a Python style retrack. It's not going to be as big of a job as Python because they did have some new supports with Python, I believe. So, you know, with all the weight bearing columns and the support structure remaining the same with Shaman, it's just replacing the track and bringing in the new modern track. Probably by, by Vacoma. It will definitely be Vacoma. Uh, bring that in. Um, and, you know, Shaman, it's one of the... It's, it, like I said, it's the first ever permanently installed roller coaster in Italy back in 1984. So, um, not obviously, it's not the first in my opinion. I think there is. It's one of the first. It's not the first. Uh, but, you know, I think Shaman is definitely a very good ride experience from the looks of it. I think it's a classic ride experience. I did prefer the overhaul of new track compared to a complete removal, just for the fact that um, it's a classic ride, it's a vintage coaster, it's great for the young guys that's coming up on the ranks of coaster riding, and you know I think Shaman will stay here for generations to come, and it's great news to see it's going to get the whole retrack, and you know, I mean, you look at the reviews of Python after the successful retrack process with that ride at F-Telling. Um, and you see a similar type of process with this. So it's going to be a very interesting sort of process to see how it looks with Shaman, how the new track's going to look. You know, is it a, a lighter shade of green, this new track, or is it the same color? If it is a different shade of green, are they going to repaint the rest of it in a different shade of green? Or is it going to be a nice collage of green? We never know. 
Uh, but I'm very happy about this news, and uh, it's great to see Godland keep this historic roller coaster. So before we, so thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. I know I said before we finish this video, and to be fair, before we finish this video, thank you so so much for half a million views in total. I can't believe we hit that. Um, it was a great milestone. I did a full video explaining my thoughts. I was speechless, but I explained it in a good video. Uh, get and check that out. Uh, we do have loads more updates and other videos coming over the next few weeks. So stay tuned for all of that to get you ready for the Christmas period. Uh, Vlogmas, that should hopefully start. I will do a video sort of closer to December to reveal more details about what Vlogmas will provide. And um, I'm going to do all of that, so make sure you stay tuned for that. But for now, guys, thank you very, very much for tuning into this video. My name is Coast Chell. Keep living the coast life. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, have a thrill-tastic day.